I've come to oh I've come to save the party or the day. I don't know which one it is. Caught you for a second, huh? <laughs> In today's video, I'm going to give you some ideas for your next superhero party decorations. So off we go to save another party. Just kidding. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel with my inspiring designs with me, Justine, where all I want to do is inspire you. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys a way to set up the superhero party decorations, give you some ideas about that. But first, if you're new here on my channel, welcome. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell to get notified on all the decor, design, and DIY projects I do here on my channel. And if you want to know some ideas on your next superhero party decoration, please keep watching. Step one is to set up a stand and backdrop. I bought this superhero backdrop from Amazon and it came with adhesive that you can stick on the backdrop to your stand along with signs that made the sound effects of the superheroes which I ended up putting on the balloon garland. So step two is to place the adhesive on the backdrop. Now what you're going to do is you're going to cut these adhesive strips into three equal parts. I just kind of eyeballed it and then you're going to place them right directly on the back of the backdrop cloth. Don't mind the picture frame centerpiece that's holding the backdrop. I actually needed something to hold on to it because it kept falling. And that was a previous project I did in my previous videos. And if you want to check it out, I'll leave the link to that video in the description box below. Step three is to place the backdrop right on the stand. The adhesive will definitely stick to the poles, so you should have no problem with that. Step four is to blow up the balloons. Now I have a strategy that I use when it comes to blowing up balloons. If you would like to know how I get it done, please see the description box below and I'll leave a few links for those directions that I put in my previous videos. Step five is to string the balloon garland. Now I'm not gonna go into detail because I've done this in my previous videos about how I string my balloons. If you wanna go check that out, please make sure to look at the description down below.
When it comes to hanging the balloon garland, I've done my zip tie tutorials before. If you want, you can also do the string or fishing line that you use to hold the balloons together. It's totally up to you. So the design question for the video is, what superhero power would you want? Hmm, I would want to save all the parties. No, I'm just kidding. I always wanted to read people's minds, but then again, I'm like, nah, I don't want that. So maybe to travel, travel different places. I think that would be so cool to not have to worry about money. Step six is to attach the signs that came with the backdrop to the actual balloon garland. All I did was use glue dots, put it right in the back, stuck them on the balloon, and it held pretty well. And last but not least, we're gonna add a dessert table to our balloon garland. Oh my goodness, guys, this dessert table came out so bomb.com. I just wanted to go into detail about what I did. I used some paper for the water bottles. I got some Hostess cupcakes that I put in a little candy dish. Um, then we also added some superhero party favors that you would take home or have your guests take home, along with some cupcakes to kind of sample what would be on the dessert table and I thought this was really cool because it was all because it was the 4th of July I found a lot of the red white and blue desserts so it worked out perfectly that on a cupcake stand is actually a chip bag that I saw I believe in Walmart one day Since I know most of you always ask where I get my stuff, I found a lot of the superhero decor in Joanne Fabrics, Walmart, Amazon, and a little bit in Michaels. If you absolutely loved this video, make sure you give it a big, big thumbs up. Please leave a comment below and let me know what's, what would be your superhero power that you would want. I love when you guys comment and message me and give me feedback because I really want this channel to be for you. Make sure to follow me on Instagram or on Facebook. All my social media links are down below. Check them out. Come say hi. I love when I get messages from you guys. If you ever watched Johnny Bravo back in the day, give us a big thumbs up because that was my cartoons back in the day. He was just like, hoo, ha. That's what I think of. Pow, bang, mm. Okay, it's time for me to go to sleep. <laughs>